Hi, I'm Janet Kleinschmidt for JLOR, and we're here today to discuss the basics of TMR feeding. TMR stands for Total Mixed Ration. And what it means is that every mouthful a cow takes will be homogeneous. In other words, it will contain the forages, the concentrates, the proteins, and the vitamins and minerals that a dairy cow needs. In North America, we tend to group our cows into a one-group system. In other words, all of the milking cows will be in a one-group TMR. They all receive the same TMR. This doesn't mean they will be in the same social group. Some producers will feed a two-group system, so there'll be a high group and a low group. The high group will receive the expensive feed ingredients and feed additives, the low group the more economical feeds. This works in terms of economics, but it's harder on the cows. Cows moving from the high group to the low group will tend to drop in production and they will not be coming back again in that lactation. In North America, we also tend to feed the TMR out once a day. During the hot, muggy weather of the summer, it's often beneficial to feed it out twice a day. Both systems work in the winter as long as you're pushing up two to three times a day. It's important that you know the dry matter intake in each of the production groups in your herd. Typically, a milk production group will be eating 24 kgs of dry matter. That's about 55 pounds of dry matter. If you ask them to eat more than that, for example, 60 pounds, you're actually going to shortchange them. They can't eat 60 pounds, and they will show it with a drop of body condition score, a drop of production, and also a drop in reproduction. A TMR is only as good as the ingredients that go into it. So the basis to any good TMR feeding system is high quality forages. Remember, focus on the TMR because nutrition matters.